Most of our subscribers asked us to compare between NMC chemistry lithium ion battery packs and LFP, LFP battery packs in electric two wheelers and out of these battery chemistries which battery chemistry is best suitable for them. In this video I am going to compare NMC chemistry lithium ion battery packs and LFP chemistry lithium ion battery packs for electric two wheelers by end of the video you can choose best chemistry for your electric vehicle. I am Krishnitanya Mandela your EV bro. Firstly I am going to compare these chemistries in several different segments. I just want to give a clear information about what is NMC. NMC means nickel manganese cobalt whereas LFE means lithium iron phosphate battery pack. Let us start with our first segment self discharge. For NMC chemistry lithium ion battery packs the self discharge is 4 percentage per month which means even if you fully charge your electric two wheeler it can be electric scooter or electric bike but if you kept the vehicle ideal condition in one month the battery pack going to discharge 4 percentage. Now you might have a doubt there is only 4 percent of discharge I don't need to worry about the battery pack even for several months because only 4 percent discharge happens in the battery pack but you need to understand one important thing here the cell discharge is only 4 percentage but for BMS also the BMS actually takes some energy from the battery pack general BMS the consumption is around 1 watt hour per hour but in case smart electric scooters like Ola, Aether, Hero, Veda electric scooters they are using telematic units 4G connectivity and ride statistics for these telematic units and all the BMS need to consume a higher amount of energy there is a possibility that is the reason in average BMS consume around 1 watt hour per hour for normal electric scooter for smart electric scooter there is a chances are high for higher consumption from the BMS. In cell wise there is a 4 percentage of self discharge for lithium ion battery packs but in the BMS consumption is also there adding to that there is a chances of faster self discharge because of the consumption of BMS power from the battery pack. So that is the reason most of the EV two wheeler companies suggest the customers to keep the scooter in complete uh, shutdown mode to avoid any self discharge or else companies like Ola Electric uh, suggesting the customers to keep the scooter in the vacation mode because if the vacation mode is on this BMS goes to sleep mode. So if the BMS go to sleep mode means the consumption will be very less. It will go from watt hour to milliwatt hour. So very less consumption will happen. So that is the reason make sure for your lithium and battery pack scooters if you are not using the scooter make it completely off position otherwise it will slightly discharge the battery pack so four percentage from cell wise whereas from bms there is a higher chances more percentage bms uh, consumption from the battery pack now coming to the lfp case lfp self discharge per month is only three percentage but on a overall level it is almost close to nmc chemistry battery pack only whatever the characteristics whatever i have uh, explained like how the bms is also consuming energy from the battery pack the same case also applicable for LFP battery pack self discharge wise more or less NMC and LFP are similar in kind similar in terms of self discharge now the second parameter is performance what will happen if you use NMC chemistry battery pack in your electric two wheeler and what will happen if you use the same vehicle with LFP battery pack there is not much performance difference even if you use NMC chemistry battery pack or LFP battery pack chemistry so performance wise similar performance in these two battery pack chemistries and the next thing is energy density for NMC chemistry packs the energy density is 150 watt hour to 200 watt hour per kilogram so there is a higher density for NMC chemistry battery pack so the weight of NMC chemistry lithium ion battery pack for 1 kilowatt hour close to 5 kilograms to 7 kilograms now coming to LFP battery pack the energy density is 100 watt hour to 150 watt hour per kilogram so compared with NMC chemistry LFP battery pack energy density is lower so that is the reason the battery pack weight higher. So the weight of LFP battery pack is 7 kilograms to 10 kilograms per kilowatt hour. And the next thing is life cycles. NMC chemistry pack on an average level, the minimum life cycles for NMC chemistry battery pack is 1000 life cycles to maximum level of 2000 life cycles. Whereas for LFP battery pack, the minimum life cycles are 2000 life cycles and up to maximum of 4000 life cycles. A life cycles means one charge and one discharge combined to form a life cycle and the next thing is cost average level taken from the low grade cells to high grade cells the minimum cost of an nmc chemistry battery pack per kilowatt hour ranging from 13,000 rupees to 14,000 rupees whereas for lfe chemistry per one kilowatt hour the cost is 
eleven thousand rupees to twelve thousand rupees. So compared with NMC chemistry, LFP battery pack cost is lesser. And the next thing is fast charging. Both NMC chemistry and LFP chemistry supports fast charging, but compared with NMC chemistries, LFP having an advantage because of the higher life cycles. Even if you use fast charging quite often there is a possibility you will get higher lifetime in lfp chemistry because of the higher life cycles and the next thing is safety for nmc chemistry battery pack there is a possible risk of thermal runaway in case of th temper high temperatures but you can avoid this by using proper bms system so nmc chemistry battery packs are temperature sensitive but whereas lfp battery packs are less temperature sensitive compared with nmc chemistry and there are less chances of fire in LFP battery pack. So that is the reason LFP battery packs are safer compared with NMC chemistry. And final thing it's about the cell quality. Even it is NMC chemistry cells or LFP chemistry cells. Today most of the cells are being imported from China and the cell quality is depend on the cost. The quality of the cell depends on the cost. The pricing starts from there is a cheap price and also higher price. For quality cell, you need to pay higher amount. The quality of the battery packs completely depending on the price here. So final conclusion, you can go with LFP battery packs. If your requirements is higher life cycles, safety and low cost. You can go with NMC chemistry battery pack. If your requirements are longer range and lightweight to handle. So after complete comparison, there are more advantages to LFP battery pack chemistry compared with NMC battery pack chemistry. But still, why almost 80 to 90 percentage of the electric two-wheeler companies in India going with NMC chemistry. Here are some interesting facts here. Compared with LFP battery pack chemistry, NMC battery pack chemistry offering higher energy density, which means these battery packs consume less volume and less weight. That is the reason most of the EV two-wheeler manufacturers are opting for NMC chemistry instead of LFP, LFP battery pack because the design constraint is very important thing for electric two-wheelers. So once again, if you are planning to buy electric two-wheeler with NMC chemistry pack or LFE battery pack, make sure quality of the cell is important irrespective of the chemistry. Even if you are going with LFP, but it is offering low quality, you don't get higher life cycle. So make sure you choose a best quality cells only then you will get higher lifetime that is the complete comparison between both these chemistries if you like this video please like share and subscribe to ev bro charge the nature try the future